everyone it's Jess welcome back to my channel um, so I recently posted a poll on my Instagram just asking what makeup look you guys wanted to see I'm just gonna show you so this is the look that I am gonna be doing today I think this is a really really pretty look um, I've been kind of getting into nudes so I'm gonna use that as reference but I don't always follow things to the T because I like to spice it up a bit so I love the eyes I probably won't try to change the eyes um, but with the face I want it more dewy so that's probably the only thing that I'm gonna do all right guys just so we're a part of the same fam do you guys want to subscribe down below and ring that bell so when I post next you see it first I have some really exciting things coming up so I can't wait to share that with you guys make sure to keep watching I also purchased these two Nikki joy products Oops, there we go so these are the lashes and this is the powder so I've heard really good things about this powder um, I, oh, I, it was the right way <laughs> um, I can't wait to try these and I can't wait to try these lashes because they look really wispy and I think they'll suit this look um, so this says that it's a velvet finish powder infused with vitamin A, E, aloe vera, sweet almond oil to gently hydrate the skin whilst controlling shine. I love anything that has vitamin A, vitamin E, aloe vera, sweet almond oil. I put that all over my face every day anyway. So um, I can't wait to use this. I did see Nikki's video as well on YouTube and the results were incredible. So this is the packaging. I really like the way it's packaged like it even says there her little name cosmetics Nikki cosmetics and then it comes obviously with a seal um, I will take it off and then there's like some little cubes so I really like how it's deep I don't think this is going to get go everywhere um, I know the Laura Mercier one is really good but it does go everywhere all the time like I try to get a bit of powder and it just all over my clothes my hair you know the jeez so I can't wait to try this because I am looking for something flawless finish, you know, the gist. So I'm going to do this eye off camera and I will be right back to show you how I do. I'm back. Um, I'm going to start by priming my eyelids with the P. Louise base. And this is in the room. Of the I'm going with the Stacey Marie X BH Perfect Cosmetics and I'm gonna first go in to I'm gonna first go into rowdy and then I'm gonna go into basic so I'm gonna just be popping this along my crease but mainly around the outer edge So I'm just going to be placing it there a bit, I'm going to take a little bit out and then just put that in the middle, I'm not going to bring it all the way, I'm not going to bring it all the way there. I'm going to use this shade to sort of blend out this colour and I am bringing it like kind of a bit below because I do want it to fade. stained pink brush and I'm just gonna very gently blend that because I don't want it too high up to my brow bone so if this has no product on it I will be dipping back into basic in a second now I'm going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Prism palette. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but we're gonna go with that anyway. So I'm taking this shade here, and this is a bit darker, and I'm gonna be putting this one into the crease just to darken it up a bit more. And I'm not gonna bring it too far in because we are gonna add the shimmers, but I just kind of want to darken it up. Hi, Scarlett! This is Scarlett, everyone. Say hello. 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 Where's Nick? Where's Nick? Nick. Nick. Hello. 
Come on, Scarlet. Come on, my shoulder. You don't want to come on? You always want to be in the queen. Hello. She doesn't want to talk. She's probably camera shy. Oh, babe, you need to like cut her nails. They're digging into my fingers. Up. Come on, Scarlett. Well, up. Up. <laughs> she doesn't want to let it go. I love her. So I'm gonna very quickly just cut my crease. I am not gonna cut the whole thing. I'm just gonna shop. So I'm dipping into Hustle from the Stacy palette and I'm gonna be putting this where I didn't put the concealer. So just there. And then I'm going on top of that with Queenie and I'm putting this all over my lid. Okay, now I'm going to be lining my lid with the Essence Super Last Eyeliner in Deep Black. So I've been trying, I tried this out yesterday and I actually liked it. So I'm going to keep giving it a go. I do wish the wand was a bit thinner. So liner's on. I'm going to be taking the Nikia Joy Cosmetics and this is the lash I'm going to be So I just applied a bit of the Lash Republic glue. Um, I really do like the Lash Republic glue, but this is what happened to mine. It's like really dirty and I don't know why, um, I don't know why that happened. If anyone else experienced stuff like that, please let me know what you did to fix it because it's actually the best glue. It's just so messy. The best thing about this glue is you don't have to wait for it to dry like it literally dries it straight away okay everyone brows are done I've already put my eye cream and normal face cream so I'm gonna be taking two primers I'm gonna be taking the Tatcha silk primer canvas and the Mac one this one is really nice because it's like very radiant so I'm going in now with the Mac strobe cream and the cover effects rose gold drops I'm just gonna apply this all over my face She's so... Oh my gosh! Taking my beauty blender and I'm just blending her in. It's like my favourite. <laughs> I'm just putting that mainly on my cheeks. <laughs> oh my god! She's calling the dogs. Mind you, these dogs like watch her like no tomorrow. Like, they're ready to eat. <laughs> Taking the Bobby Brown stick and this is in Warm Almond. Jesus. She just said Jesus. That is actually incredible because today's Good Friday so Jesus died today. Because I want this to be more contoured and bronze, so I'm actually bringing it down here. I'm going in with the Huda Beauty Foundation and this is in Macchiato. Macchiato? I don't know. Macchiato. Oh my god, I better not be running out. This is my favorite foundation. This is like so full coverage. I love this foundation. See how that just intensifies my neck? <laughs> Mima! So I'm going in with the Born This Way Concealer and I'm going in with like one drop of the Tarte Shape Tape. Literally one drop each. I don't know about you, but I love concealer. So I probably put a bit too much, but I don't really care. Okay, everyone, I can't... Really scarlet. Now I'm going to take the NJC powder. So apparently you can use this under the eyes. I am just going to test it. 
under the eyes and around the whole face. So, so I heard that you're meant to shake it and then you open it and then apparently whatever is on the lid you're meant to use. Um, I really like the smell of this. Um, I already can tell a difference. I want to zoom you in because I want you to see. Um, I'm not going to set my whole face, but I love setting my nose. Okay, I'm just going to zoom you guys in even more. Um, this is incredible. My skin looks flawless. Okay, I love this powder so much. Can you just see how like it just covers every little blemish I have? Like, and this is the first time I've ever set with this. So definitely gonna use that again. Yeah, I love it. I thought it was like kind of not fake, but you know, not that real. But Nikia, you did an amazing job. I'm gonna use the Marc Jacobs bronzer. I love this so much. Oh my gosh, I don't think anyone understands how much I love this. And I'm just gonna obviously put a bit of powder under my eyes and then we'll re rekindle when I do my lips. And the highlight, BRB. I'm gonna use the Champagne Pop um, Becca Cosmetics highlight with Jaclyn Hill. It is broken, I'm so sad. I don't know how to fix it. I know that some people suggest like rubbing alcohol and stuff, but I'm so scared to do it. I can't believe I stopped using this. I don't know why. It's just such a perfect shade. All right, I'm back. I just smoked out my lower lash line. So I'm gonna be lining my lips with the Max of Culture. And I like these to line and overline as well. Okay, so I'm gonna be taking the MAC Velvet Teddy and I really, really like this lipstick. It's just such a nice nude. I'm gonna be putting the Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm. This is, oh. Just Alright everyone, this is the final result! Alright everyone, this is the final result. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe and hit that little bell. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Mwah. Bye guys!